In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up autofill on Chrome. So Chrome autofill is a feature that's extremely easy to set up. And once it's done, it can really enhance your browsing experience and save you a lot of time. So how it works is that you can save three types of information in autofill. First is your password. After that, you can save your payment information. And the third is your address, which is all the general info, like your name, your mobile number, and where you're from. So once this is saved, the next time you fill in a form, you won't have to fill in any of this information. So let's get straight into it. So the first thing you have to do is go to Chrome. And after that, you've got to click on the three dots that are on the top right over here. After that, you'll have to click on settings, which you'll find at the bottom. And now we've reached settings. On the left, you'll see many options and you've got to select the second one that's autofill. And as you can see, there are three things that we can fill in. Passwords, payment information, and addresses. So I'll quickly show you each one of these. So starting with passwords, just click on password manager over here. And at the bottom, you can see all of your saved passwords. So for now, I only have one. But if I want to add a new password, I can click on add that's over here. Then here, I have to enter the website. So let's say I want to add my username and password for Instagram. So for site, I'll put Instagram.com. After that, just enter your username and password. And once this is done, click on save. And now let's see if it works. So I'll just click on Instagram.com. And as you can see, my username and password have automatically come here. And if I click on login, then I'm logged in. After that, they have a few settings. So if you want to edit a certain password, then what you can do is click on the three dots next to it. And then you can edit the password or delete it completely. And they have a couple of more settings. The first one is to offer to save passwords every time you enter a password on a certain website. And the second one is auto sign in. So in this, it'll automatically enter your details and you won't manually have to sign in. So I usually keep both of these on. Now I've come back and I'll show you how to add addresses. So click on the third option that's over here. And to add an address, just click on add that's written over here. And as you can see, this is what all you can fill in. So once you enter it over here, then every time you fill in a form, it'll automatically enter this information. So I'll quickly add this. And once you've entered the information, just click on save. And the same way, you can edit or delete this address by clicking on the three dots that are over here. And you'll find both the options here. And then just enable this setting on top, which will save and fill the address when you're filling in a form. So now the last thing you can autofill is payment information. For that, select payment methods. And the same way, next to payment methods, just click on add to add your payment information. Here you can enter all of your card details and then click on save. And then you'll have to keep the first two settings enabled. So in the first one, it'll automatically fill your payment details. And in the second setting, it'll allow sites to check if you've payment methods saved on your laptop. So this is basically how autofill works on Chrome. And if you want to know 10 Google search tricks, then check out this video over here. That's it for today. Goodbye.